guys, before I say anything, thank you for 100,000 views over on the YouTube channel. Guys, I started this YouTube channel two years ago. I never thought I'd even hit 50,000. But here we are, hitting 100,000 views. Guys, thank you so much for supporting me for so long. And guys, let's keep continuing this channel and let's make it stronger. So guys, I have some exciting news. And yes, it is. Here it is. One UI. 3.0 on the a7 2018 so guys pretty much this is a m31 samsung port so it's pretty much taken directly from that phone so when i do show you the, about the phone it's going to show you m31 but guys i can ensure you that this is not an m31 i'm actually recording this on my a7 2018 so guys just to put it out there right now Please get this video to 30 likes. I'm turning 30 likes because guys, this is such an epic video. One UI 3.0 on the A7 2018. I never thought this day would be coming, but it's here. So guys, please smash the like button to 30. But as you can see in the video, um, it has all the themes for One UI 3.0. And later I'll show you even more in the setting panel. But it's very well done. There is actually no lag. It's one of the smoothest roams I have ever tested. And that's pretty surprising since it's One UI 3.0. See guys, now I'll show you the about the phone. See, it does say Samsung Galaxy M31, but it's not an M31. It's just taken from the um, port M31, but that's it. And also guys, they are releasing other ports like Samsung Galaxy S20, um samsung galaxy s10 so if you guys want to see those sports videos please make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn down turn on the notification box let me know notification icon sorry guys and yeah there are many other features such as i don't know why i clicked the user panel but i did i just want to show you guys everything so guys the connections and also guys, Violite does work on this ROM, so all my Indian fans out there who use Violite and whoever else also uses Violite, it does work, so there's no need to worry about that. Display, and guys, it does have the display animation, the smooth animation to switch from light to dark. We did not have this in the One UI 2.5 ROM. Guys, an update on that, I don't think I'm even going to release the video for it, because I don't see there's no point. Now we have this ROM. And when you have 3.0, there is actually no reason to release the 2.5 one. For some strange reason, the the maker of the ROM, which was not me, does not want me to upload it yet, and I need his permission in order to upload the video. So guys, let's just delay that. It's okay. I can upload this video since the creator does not mind. So yeah, guys. But as usual, the ROM is not perfect. As you, um, as I did show you in the beginning of the video. You guys might be running, there is no camera. There is no camera shortcut because there is no camera um, app on this phone. But you, you can use third party apps. I do recommend you guys checking out my Google camera apps. Which you can use on this room. It works perfectly. If you guys want me to demonstrate that in the next video. Make sure to comment down below. And also guys, when we are at the topic of comment down below. If you guys uh, have some such for some video ideas that you would like me to do put them in the comment below i always do read my comments and i really do base my videos off that so thank you guys for doing that so yeah guys so back to the video so the lock screens and also guys i did show the wallpapers guys the wallpapers in this room are amazing they're very vivid i really couldn't find any other wallpaper when i actually flashed the room and looked at the wallpaper i was like whoa the wallpaper is actually very stunning advanced features there's a side key feature as i said guys i still have to explore this room because as soon as i put it i made this video because i also want you guys to know about it but guys don't worry a video is coming soon just get this video to 30 likes and i will upload the video as device care as usual See guys, I'm just trying to show you everything in this room. It's really amazing after so long we got um, 
something for the A7 2018. I was worried it's still gonna die, but they brought it back. So yeah, guys, this is the standard um, switching to apps. You can just slide on the down the bottom of the screen, left to right. Here's the app drawer. As you can see, as I mentioned, there is no camera app, but you can download one of the Google um, camera apps that I do mention in my channel. Oh yeah, guys, speaking of Google Camera, there is going to be an update on that, so stay tuned for that. So yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Goodbye!